All right, so in this video, we're gonna learn how to create a cinema graph inside of Premiere Pro. Now, essentially what a cinema graph is, is that it's kind of like the mixture between a video and a photo. So it's essentially just a still photo with a few moving elements in it. So something like this or this. Now, as you can see, there are a lot of still components in the photo but there are a few things in there that are moving and that's essentially what a cinema graph is now you can do this both in photoshop and in premiere but in this tutorial i'm going to stick to premiere if you guys would like to see me do it in photoshop well then leave a comment below all right so let's get started you want to go to the first frame on your clip and you want to export that frame and then you want to drag that frame on top of your clip and then you want to adjust your length so that it matches the clip right beneath it. Now you want to click on this clip and go to the effects control panel and go to this opacity tab right here. Next you want to choose the pen tool and you want to just mask around this opening of the bottle right here. Right? And as you can see I'm masking around the cup and you'll see why I did that in just a minute. And now what you want to do is that you want to click on this checkbox right next to inverted. Now, if we move a little forward, as you can see, the only thing that's moving now is the milk and not the bottle itself. So that's it for this video. Now let's take a look at what we just did. So I hope you guys liked that video. If you did, make sure you hit the like button and you might want to check out some of my other videos. So I'll leave links to those at the end of this one. And while you're at it, you might want to subscribe to this channel.